The expectance of discovery is a heightened desire to realise ancient secrets, and for hundreds of years knowledge of advanced disciplines was a crime. Seen as sorcery or witchcraft and inflicting this fear wherever interest would arise was the infliction by the ruler of the time. But all over the world, throughout the different ages, secrets have been kept from an elitist group who only seek to keep a hold over their surroundings. Wait till you hear this. Back in 2007, the Farron Sun duo Tommy and Stuart Mitchell revealed to the world that at Roslyn Chapel, a music score existed that they had deciphered and was then played by an orchestra in concert. Carvings on the 600 year old Roslyn Chapel in Scotland represent a coded form of a musical mystery in its architecture and design. At one end of the chapel, on the ceiling are four cross sections of arches containing elaborate symbolic designs on each array of cubes. The cubes are attached to the arches in a musically sequential way. And to confirm this, at each end of the arc, there is an angel playing a musical instrument of a different kind. And after 27 years of study and research by Tommy Mitchell, he revealed he had found the pitches and tonality that matched the symbols on each cube, revealing its melodic and harmonic progressions. The musical score has been frozen in time at the chapel for 600 years. Inside the chapel, there are 13 angels that Tommy has called the Orchestra of Angels, which are carved into the chapel's arches and who appear to be musicians. Surrounding the angels are 213 geometric symbols that were found to resemble sound waves at different pitches. After decoding all the symbols to match the sound waves, they found a song which researchers say is part of the Somatics music system, which is the study of wave phenomena associated with physical patterns produced through the interaction of sound waves in a medium. Tommy said in an interview that, It is what we call frozen music, a little like cryogenics. The music has been frozen in time by symbolism. It was only a matter of time before the symbolism began to fall out and begin to make sense to scientific and musical perception. The Mitchells describes the song as sounding like a Celtic melody or a nursery rhyme. The unusual combination of instruments, their dynamics, tunings and textures recreate a sound long forgotten from our past. The melodies are simple but harmonically develop and unfold in the most simplistic but charming way. The sequential arrangement of the cubes at many times is a series of repeated notes signifying a more functional than aesthetic sense to the music. Sometimes it sounds like a nursery rhyme and there's also a feeling of a Celtic air about the music. The Mitchells have added words from a contemporary hymn to the music and have named the composition the Roslyn Motet, which is performed by the Talis Chamber Choir and produced by Stuart Mitchell. 